once a normal looking guy, Eric Sprague has gone to great lengths to radically transform his body. He's the Lizard Man, an outcast by design. Without further ado, I would like to introduce the little green man, the freak of nature, the Lizard Man. These days, Eric works as a sideshow performer. Today, he's on stage at a tattoo convention outside Syracuse, New York. It's a sympathetic crowd. But Eric knows that the rest of the world isn't so accepting of what he's done to his body. There are a lot of people that do not have the guts to recognize the fact that they are individuals and to express it to the rest of the world. By radically marking the visible parts of his body with pointed teeth, green scaly skin, and Teflon implants under his eyebrows, Eric sends a message that he no longer wants to play by society's rules. For those at the tattoo show, Eric's message is clear. He's willing to go to greater lengths than most to set himself apart. For many in this modified crowd, that makes him something of a hero. Body piercer Danny Van Buren has decided to follow Eric's lead and take his markings public. Okay, brother. Danny will be pricked with a needle for almost three hours. It's a painful process. I don't care if you, have, you don't have a tattoo, but I should be allowed to cover my body however I want. Ultimately, Danny wants his entire body covered with ink. He wants to be just like Eric. Yeah, looks good from here. <laughs> You'll never get to see it from this perspective, but it looks good from here. <laughs> when it's finally over, Danny is happy to have joined Eric's ranks. Three hours of drilling on the skull. I'm so glad I did this and went down to this extent with it. And there's no turning back now, so I'm just going to keep going and going and going. For the members of this modification community, Eric continues to be a trailblazer. Before heading back to Austin, he's getting another tattoo in a very sensitive place. This time, his lips will be turned from pink to green. The first thing I'm going to do, I'm going to take a darker green and I'm going to make my ridge line. Eric's still hoping to have almost 300 more hours of work done on his body before his transformation is complete. Choosing to live life as a lizard man 24-7 isn't for most people. But for Eric and others willing to cross the line, becoming an outcast is a price they're willing to pay for being true to how they see themselves, no matter what that makes them in the eyes of others. <laughs>